Hey comic book fans, welcome back to Comic Book Corner 2.0 and fans, you're back with me, Mike Spider Slayer, getting ready to do Road to Comic of the Year results for group number seven and to give you a little insight on what the viewer's choice portion of this video series is. So welcome back everybody. Um, again, this is the video series where you the fans get to pick which books you want nominated for comic of the year and once we get all those books situated again you vote for those final picks so with that being said let's recap uh group number seven on which books we were talking about for last week and first off it was saga chapter 31 robin hood issue number 11 Guardians of the Galaxy, issue number 26. Grim Tales of Terror, issue number 8. Ant-Man, the last volume, issue number 2. The Walking Dead, issue number 144. And last but not least, Tokyo Ghost, issue number 2. Well, would you guys vote for? Was an Ant-Man. No one cared about Ant-Man. Poor Ant-Man didn't get any votes whatsoever. I'm sorry, Ant-Man. You're not there. Next, Guardians of the Galaxy. No love. Sorry, maybe next year. <coughs> Poor Robin Hood. Um, I think that this book was my number one pick maybe three times in this whole video series so far. But it's just a series I feel that no one, it's an under the radar series and no one reads it. So it doesn't get that consideration. So no one voted for Robin Hood. Well, I did, but it was like one vote. And last but not least, I think the one that doesn't get the vote is Grim Tales of Terror. That doesn't get the vote either. So, which one out of these three? Get picked this week? Well, it wasn't Saga. Saga did not get picked. So, in the end, it was The Walking Dead and Tokyo Ghost. And the winner of this week's round goes to The Walking Dead, issue number 44. Uh, I am satisfied with this pick. It, it's actually uh, a really well done issue, and it's the first time that um, The Walking Dead gets uh, that nomination for Comic of the Year, so that fits in nicely. We got an image book in there as well. And then so the wild card goes to Tokyo Ghost where the wild card round will be presented to everybody next week and to see if those titles that made it into the wild card round, you have a second chance for that title. So, all right. So now we introduce to you guys the, the viewer's choice. So the viewer's choice is very simple. The more audience participation for this particular round, obviously the better uh, because we'll get more input, more comics. And really what the viewer's choice is, is if there is a book out there that you loved and enjoyed the most, um, put it down, write it down. And if that book gets multiple votes, that's how it gets thrusted into nominated for comic of the year. The second most gets the wild card pick. It's very simple. For instance, last year, a lot of people were like deadly class, deadly class, deadly class. And that wound up becoming nominated for comic of the year. And it, I think it actually wound up winning. No, it didn't come in winning. It wound up coming in second. So uh, that's what happened there. Uh, so there you have it, guys. Viewer's Choice Week. Pick which book you thought was your favorite book of the year. Hopefully it gets multiple vo votes and then it gets thrusted into nominated of comic of the year. So guys, as always, thank you for watching Comic Book Corner 2.0. Until that next comic book review, this is Mike Spider Slayer signing off. Take care, guys. Bye.